bad habits from, from anybody since you all live in the same space? Anything outstanding that you can talk about? Well, I wouldn't um, say bad habits. Um, I would say um, we are 16 girls, right? My room, we are 10. So we, people have different traits, different characters, different behaviors. So you just have to find a way to be okay with what someone else is doing. Because you need to understand that somebody is also trying to be tolerant or to tolerate you. So in that order, you need to also do the same for people. And just understand that um, we've grown from different places and we're different people. So we just have to find a blend or a fix or a mix somewhere. So it's been okay. It's been okay. Would you say you're well behaved? Would I say I'm well behaved? I would say I'm okay. Because what does that mean? <laughs> There's nothing like okay. It doesn't mean anything. <laughs> I'm saying that because um, I might think that I'm okay or I'm well behaved or this, but um, someone else somewhere is really, really, really being tolerant with a lot of things I am doing and the person is not being so okay with it. So, yeah, I, I don't want to say I'm well behaved because I'm sure one or two I might be inconveniencing another person that I might not necessarily know that that is what I'm doing. So, that is but considered. I think I, I, I am I am okay. Right. <laughs> anyway, so you've been in the house for a while now. Yes. You've yes. Um, developed relationships. Yes, yes. As it were. Yes. Who do you like at, in the house? Who's your favorite person and why? Who do I like? I like all 16 girls. It must be one person or two people yes. that you really like, that you share your meals with, that you have your convos with, that you have served, that serve as your confidants. Okay, I, I like I said earlier, I think I like all of us because uh, we all have different things we contribute to make our lives better you in one way or the other. But Why don't you just get to it? <laughs> <laughs> but I'm sure um, all the girls know who I'm going to mention. I think I'm, I'm closer to Essie okay. I think I'm more closer to Essie I like um, Aiko. Aiko is very, very patient. I like the fact that she is a patient person. She, she finds what is it about Essie then? I, I like a lot of things about Essie I like a lot of things about her. She's interesting to be with. Um, she's comforting. She's calm. She's jovial. The, I like so many things about her, as I do about um, the rest of the girls as well, but I can't mention think, them all. Do you think Esiedua could win? Do I think it's, I think Esiedua is very good. I mm. think she is very, very good. And um, I know she's representing her region to the best of her ability and kudos to her for that. She is good. I see. Yeah. Who's your least favorite person? I haven't, I don't have a least favorite person yet. I don't have a least favorite person. Well, rumor person. has it that you do, so you might as well come out with it. Well, <laughs> I don't. Honestly, I don't, I don't think um, I have this particular person that I'm thinking, no, I don't like her so much. Mm -hmm. No, not yet, not yet. Maybe right. this is just um, a month as time goes on. I don't know, maybe. <laughs> um, I hear you are the sort of, in quotes, spokesperson for the rest of the girls in the house and um, when you have meetings, you're on top of things, <laughs> speaking for everybody. Where did you learn to do that? Um, I wouldn't say I have learned it somewhere per se. You know, growing up, my dad has always said, anytime he's mad at me for something, he'll be like, and when they talk, when they are talking, all you know how to do is to speak English. <laughs> so. So I, I think it's, it's just um, something in me. It's something in, I don't think I've learned it um, from anywhere. But I think I also try to listen when people speak. So I pick up a lot of things here and there and then, yeah. You know eviction uh, week will be coming up pretty soon. <laughs> yes, yes. How does that make you feel? Do you have that fear of eviction, especially the first one? <laughs> um. Honestly, I am anxious. I am anxious um, because, but I, I feel okay to knowing that even before we came to be a part of GMB, we all know that all 16 girls cannot go to the finals. Mm. And whatever you do, there will come a day when 
someone would have to go home and someone will be crowned the queen. So you just have to find solace and um, yeah, you have to find solace somewhere and be okay. If, if somebody has to go home this week, who would you rather it be? I wish no one would go home. I but, wish no one would go home. But if somebody had to go, who would you pick? I, I wouldn't pick anyone. I really wouldn't pick anyone. Left Honest or truth? Honest truth, I wouldn't pick anyone. Right. Because I feel if, if somebody picked you, you never know. Other people have been here to see me. Well, that's fine. That's okay. <laughs> <laughs> that's okay. But I wouldn't pick anyone. I think we are all so good and we'll miss each other if one person should be Would out. you want to go for the others to stay since you like everybody? No, I don't want to go. <laughs> <laughs> I don't I want to go. I want to stay. I want to stay. Well, it's been fun talking to you. Thank say you so to much. Thank you. You have a minute to do that. All right, I want to say a very big thank you to everyone. Thank you so much for your support, for your encouragement, for all that you have been doing for me. Thank you. And as I said earlier, I'm going to do my best to ensure that the crown is home in the Upper West region. Very well. Thank you for coming, Agbang. This is the end of your first session. You may take your leave. Thank you so much. I'm grateful. Thank you.